because like we said, these these ladies are so much more than eye candy. Even as you get caught up in their beauty mm-hmm. and their style and their sense of fashion, uh, there's so much more even beneath the skin as you get into their head. And and they're also entrepreneurial. Yes. Doing their own brands, doing their own thing, their own products. That's right. So everybody, welcome our guests. Mm-hmm. Erica Valdez, everybody. Yeah. Erica. Oh, you love that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Take a look. Yeah. I, can't, I have to start it that way. Hello, you luscious lovers. <laughs> Girl, <laughs> let's look at you. Let's, let's look at her. I know. See, because you know her color. Right. You know, she's very appetizing to look at. And, it's the, and I, part of it is her wonderful use of color. Thank you. But that's that's how you look in the scrumptious. Over Did you there. have your colors done? <laughs> My colors? Yeah. This is a brand new outfit. It is Chanel. We oh, yes. love Mama Shane. <laughs> um, I just love it. Um, I, I, I'm in, 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 amazed by this outfit. It, it's so cute. Again, We're amazed. Like, yeah, it's so, it's so <laughs> adorable. <laughs> you know, no, and classy too. Back. Yes. It's Classy lush. too. It's a luscious lava. <laughs> we were looking forward, you guys, to having Erica Valdez come back. Now, those of you who have seen her here before, she's always on a pioneering venture. Yes. She's one of our true divas. Okay, <laughs> beautiful, uh, so much doing things, and we couldn't wait to have her back in the studio with our own Fun Day Monday person, exactly. <laughs> Brandy Flores, because Brandy <laughs> is so much involved too with promoting brands and the like mm-hmm. and because Erica's going to talk a little bit about a pageant yes, and I'm some excited. of her own product lines. So uh, come on, tell us, so what have you been doing? Oh my gosh, I can't believe it's been almost a year, <laughs> but so much has changed. I, well, where to start? Actually, we'll start with the pageant. Yeah. I'm entering a beauty pageant at the end of um, next week. I'm actually representing our great state of California. <laughs> um, it's for a really good, it's, as you can see. That's a good <laughs> It's actually for a really good cause. Um, my director, Miss Janet, her daughter, unfortunately, passed away in a car accident, um, of, you know, prior to. Wow. And so now um, it's in honor of her. And we promote seatbelt uh, safety awareness, making sure people wear their seatbelts so we can avoid, you know, losing lives and, and, and safety There's lives. There's just so many That's moms good, who don't exactly, do it. Exactly. So, That's as you good. can see, it says buckle up. So. Yeah, I was trying to put the sexy back in seatbelt. <laughs> <laughs> so many people don't wear their seatbelts. I get so irritated. I always tell my friends, please buckle up, wear your seatbelt, and people are. Do sick. we need to decorate the seatbelts? Like, have a little. No. Here's what you do. You show them the pictures with the big old scar down the middle of your forehead. That. You know, and everybody who meets you tries to act <laughs> like they're not looking at the scar, but you know, in reality, they're really looking at the big old scar mm. that goes down the middle of your forehead because you didn't have a seatbelt on and you went through the windshield. We, ne- we need. To put sexy back in the seat. Oh, I can't show a six year old that. She'll have nightmares. Um, They'll be buckling up. I think if I bedazzled it, she would wear it a lot more. Well, that's the scared of the parents, but you got to do it. You know, it's a law mm-hmm. in California. And the one thing that people don't realize is that even when you have a minor accident or just a quick stop without the seatbelt, no one's hurt, but little Riri goes running, goes right through the windshield and rolls down the street. Mm-hmm. Okay? Mm-hmm. With no yeah, one I'm else hurt. Ahead. So it really is an important deal. It yeah, is, it definitely. is. And, you know, um, I hope that I will win the pageant. It's going to be held in Montana. I've never been wow. to our great state of Montana. Montana's nice. I'm very excited. Cow chips. Wow. Cow chips are out there. We have a parade. And, uh, <laughs> it's just going to be a lot of fun. And so which, what sanction is this? Um, where is it exactly? No, what sanction? Like I, but the pageant I did was like uh, it was called the Miss pa- oh, the Miss, is- or Miss United States, M-I-S-S United States. Mm-hmm. This is America's Super Miss. Okay. And um, it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm really excited. And thank you for having me here. So today. what's so their I'm website? Is it America? Do you know? Uh, yes, it's super uh, americasuperpageant.com. Okay. So, yeah, it's going to be fun. And did you have to go and you got sponsors? and? To, no, no, I just, just decided to do it. Okay. And, and I'm really excited. So. Now, Vic it's sent fun. over some stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because Vic sent over some stuff. Uh, yes. To tell me, he sent me over notice mm-hmm. uh, about the product line, and he sent me a link to a website at www.facesbygreta. That's right. That's my really good friend. She has a product line, and it's all anti-aging. She's very cutting edge. Um, I'm anti-aging. Yes, you, you, you have Viagra. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, you both look really good. <laughs> All three of you. But to preserve I'm at, your beauty. I'm anti-aging. 
Yeah. <laughs> I need anti-aging. Well, I'm going to bring you back. So I'm going to bring you some samples a little bit later. I, I, I'm yeah. telling you, today has been a rough one. I don't even think a nail technician with a whole lot of gel and acrylic can fix this today. Because I Girl, you look good. Oh, what are you talking great. about? Wow. Was, you yeah, look seriously. good. It's a bit much. No, you, you do, and I'd like to tell you. Thank well, you. the product. Look at this product line, everybody. We they can that's take a look Freda. at it. That's that's her. That's the uh, that's my friend Ronnie, who's very hot. Huh. Unfortunately, he's gay, but oh. otherwise I'm we'll just totally wait for a second. Now. We'll show. We're I'm gonna... trying to convince him to come to the other side. Let's show him the product. Switch on that <laughs> desktop. I've heard it never works. I don't know. I've I've had some experiences where where yeah. I've. I've Made oh, you know, maybe it's just close close attempt, attempt. <laughs> and, and succeeded. No, your Chanel dress seriously just so, brings this whole look together. Thank you. So, Erica, what are you doing with the faces? How did you get involved with this? I've known Greta now for about seven or eight years, and uh, a good friend of mine introduced us. And I, I actually was, um, you know, wanting to anti-age myself also, mm -hmm. and just, just. Even got, though you're looking wonderful, you wanted you. to anti-age yourself. Got very um, addicted to her, her products and her facials. She's out of Santa Monica. Um, she's a master at what she does. And, and there's Ronnie again. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> so I just wanted to plug her line also because just as a favor because it is really, really, really good. And I know that a lot of people out there could benefit from it. Um, do you, you keep know. your facials up like once a month? What do you do? I try to see her at least once a week. Once a week? Yeah. With in, like she's facials. She's a diva. <laughs> no, How, uh, keep those toes your toes that's all right love. well these days it's different i guess once a week so, so yeah. i'm older now sometimes more but i you know I, I enjoy her facials and i just told her i was like you know what since i'm gonna go on the show in fact you know if, you, if you're interested maybe one day she can come and talk uh she's great she's from belgium so she has a very sexy european accent mm. Mm. We can have a little they skincare have segment. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> She's Belgian born. She's Belgian, Belgian chocolate. Yeah, see, that's what that's the it's the chocolate first. That's She's, what we're supposed to think. Yes. Of. As long as she brings me some chocolate. And then, other than that, uh, you know. She's European. I've been to uh, Europe now. This is going to be my third time in a year. Last year, um, right before, right before I went to Europe, I was here. And uh, I got what I think I talked to you. I yes, called you, you from yes. I heard, uh -huh. I heard rumors. She was in the south of France. South of France, rumors. calling. And, and I was I, I was in Long Beach. No, I'm just kidding. She she had it better than I did. I missed you both so much. It was so much. I almost got detained in France because uh, thanks to Bank of America, my it was the craziest story ever. Um, it, it wouldn't go through to pay the hotel, so I had to wire transfer like a lot of money to the hotel, and it never reached them. So they actually made me stay there for like three days and I was going to be threatened to get arrested. That's what they do, people. I know that's happened to other people. don't realize bad. in foreign countries they have different laws. I, well, I don't go to, to a foreign country unless I pay your somebody. bills. I've known someone kept in Mexico. <laughs> a promoter who, when the promotion didn't go through, was kept in Mexico for a w over a week. Mm. It was the single most probably stressful experience I've had in my life because it was b because of Bank of America's fault unfortunately they just you know they never delivered the money to them and every day would pass and I would look at the clock and say oh my gosh I'm missing my flight again because of you know, the times yeah so that was really stressful um, and I I really can't give you the full effect of the story, but... Did it, you at least just go and lay out all day since you knew it wasn't going to be till tomorrow? Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> and drink. I'd have been like, okay, no pina colada. Oh, eventually, eventually, too, the hotel manager, when she actually spoke to Bank of America, she was like, girl, she's like, now I get it, like, what, what the matter is. She's like, Erica, you, you can never bank with these people ever again. And then she's like, let me buy you a grilled cheese sandwich because you are in the dire straits here. And I'm like, yeah, it's really pathetic, so... It was kind of a um, just word from word to the wise, from the wise, excuse me. Mm -hmm. When you when you travel, have backup resources. Give Vic and Mario some cash in advance. Yeah, I know. <laughs> if you get into a bind, you can just I'm send that. it on over. Pack stereo is gonna take care of you. Exactly. I, that, you're always keepers. willing to hold your money. Yes. We are minute, the keepers. Anytime. That's right. Please love us. Yes. It was not. And I just, you know, anyways, and I wrote a book about hotels um, called It's Our Pleasure. And um, it's practical advice for the seasoned traveler or the novice traveler. Did you bring traveler. it? No, no, oh. actually, um, it's funny that the, the, the woman prior to me about publishing, I'm actually opening my own publishing house. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> what are you wow. going to call it? Yeah. I don't know. I'm okay. going to wow. call, call it Vic and Mario. Oh, <laughs> <my God>. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we should start. Yeah, we'll, <laughs> <laughs> we'll all <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> so I, uh, I'm really looking forward to it. I'm going to publish. Uh, I wrote a book called The Book of Bitches. Oh, I like that. it already. No. <laughs> it's shock factor. I love shock factor. It's what we need. It's that how, sounds interesting. It is. It's how to identify and uh, how, how to identify and diffuse bitches in your life. Mm. Oh, I can. Oh, I want to. I because I want to <laughs> compare with my techniques. And how to actually manifest your own inner bitch. <laughs> Man, become, yeah. So you don't become a bitch. Oh, okay, I so mean, the man versus like woman. So well, you want to see I, it. I, I, my inner bitch manifested years ago. <laughs> they actually had to right? tell us. <laughs> so I give practical you, advice how to. <laughs> Them, you know, we deal with bitches all the time. Who does? Who hasn't had that experience? Oh, that's so cool. that's going to be published. Do you just ignore the bitches? What's your way? Um, there are different tactics. It depends on what type of bitch you're dealing with. Mm -hmm. You know. Mm. What about it? How um, about one fine ass bitch? That's a good one. Actually. <laughs> what about one of your boyfriend's exes? And fine she, crazy <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Buy out bitches. Meet you have way bitches. Oh, oh, no, broke wow. bitches. Broke bitches. bitches. Yeah, broke bitches. In there. I know how to broke bitches around. <laughs> she have a want to be your friend, bitches. <laughs> uh, single white female bitches. Yes. Single white female. We get those. I, I, but I haven't had one of those in a while. Male bitches. <laughs> male. Those bitches. are around. There are actually two types of male bitches. One of them's when they're wet behind the ears, and that's like you can't get anything from. You them, need to write that. Not book. even a roll of toilet paper. <laughs> that's your next book. <laughs> Wait, I'm loving I this. Love it. Right. Toilet paper. <laughs> Wow, <laughs> Erica, that's so that's okay. All of that, okay, okay. We want to see all of that. We yeah, we want to see all of yes, that. Whatever you want to come back. Oh my god. Yeah, we can come back. That sounds Wait. like a segment. I think that's our segment on Brandy's oh channel. Oh my goodness. Thursday. And we're making a Thursday. Another, another. Well, in in, in enculé means a hole in French. That's another way of saying I should the enculé bitch. I actually um Onkule, I love that. What? <laughs> so I can say onkule bitch and she's not gonna oh I don't say the bitch though, just say onkule. A friend of mine wrote some lyrics, um it's it's a cover of Calvin Harris, um, you know, we fell in love in a hopeless place. So but I call mm -hmm. it I fell in love with an onkule. Onkule. Oh man. And, I fell in love with Oh man, I got literally some and figuratively. I love it. I gotta come back on it. No, seriously, I'm gonna come back again and this time I'm gonna bring the C D. I just recorded it. Oh, Mario, me. you didn't know this part. Good. This this is the part, record, sing, singing. I I, I missed that whole I part. Okay, so so okay, so okay, so we can always invite Erica back to do a show where she lays some tracks, right? That's yes. right. And she has the tracks. Yes. We could we could videotape her. Okay, we can videotape her laying the track. So let's let's let, let's make some promises here. We mm -hmm. should see Erica Valdez back. Yes. That's right. With, with more videos about her product lines. Yes. Her books, her experiences. Yes. We should have her singing. She should have her own internet television yes, channel. Yes, I see it. Woo! Have it. It's happening. It's happening. They got a fashion sense. <laughs> That's true. All He's the shoes. Her. Yes. And I want to I wanna give a shout out really fast to one of my very, very favorite, favorite friends, the one actually that wrote the song for me. And so instead of saying yellow diamonds in the light, it says yellow diamonds up your ass. <laughs> it's a very <laughs> funny a, a, I love it. And um, I, his name is Jordan, and I wanted to thank him very much for the lyrics and all of his hard work. Thank you, Jordan. Ooh, thank you, Jordan. Oh, you yeah. Know, I, and uh, wait a minute, I gotta ask something because I think she's already there. You're feeling a little bit better now, aren't you? Yes, I'm feeling. Yes. I knew. Yes. I knew once I was here and, and, and getting the good energy, flow, <laughs> I would feel better. I, I really, really had to fight this morning to uh, to be here, but I, you're absolutely. I would. I'm just getting up early. For me, my I was seriously up at six, and I just couldn't stop thinking. And yeah, my dog's kicking me. I understand me. that thinking. Kid kicking me. <laughs> Man, it so gets in the way. I've been doing a, a just <laughs> been really really busy. Uh, and, um, all the things, but just really really busy, and, and and it'll catch up with you. And I'm not much, very much a night owl. I'm very much a night owl, so getting up in the morning can be a little bit. Which well, been okay. It's always been so a difficult thing. When you yeah. come back, this is what I tell our friends to remember. Sometimes we can shoot segments and we're more than willing and then we can show that video right. on the morning coffee. So you can come by in a time that's more fitting okay. to what you're doing and then we'll record that segment and we'll play it back. Okay? Yeah. Yes. yes. And give you a little flexibility. Even though I do want to see that video, she shot something in the south of France. I remember she was out like at a hotel or resort. Mm -hmm. Palm trees. Everything was in the background, Mario. And somebody was shooting. I can't remember the guy's name. That video, I, I didn't get to talk to you about it, but I want to know what that's about. Maybe another I, time. Absolutely. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring, uh, I'll compile everything because there was like a fireworks show right outside of, outside of my balcony, right over the 
uh, French Riviera, which was pretty, pretty cool. Um, who, who, who gets that, right? Yes. That was a gift from the universe. Yeah. And I did record a lot of it. So, um, yeah, I'd love to take, we'll do one day where you can come with me on my European adventure. Uh -oh. We'll leave out the part uh, where I almost got detained. You that know. was really a good part. <laughs> that. that was really an interesting part. <laughs> well, we can we can do an interactive thing. I'll just bring a wad of cash <laughs> to you. We'll watch the video, and at the part where it gets bad and like I almost get detained, you can hand it to me and be like, "Whoa, whoa." Uh, uh, that's meow, easy. Meow. That's that easy was one. insane. Oh, yeah, Dunks. yeah, and and I felt real bad, Mario, seeing all those Woo! wonderful yachts out there in the water. Oh yeah, for sure. Yes. Yeah, oh. Definitely. We need to, um, you know, I was saying also that last year it would have been fun to get one day a, a, a suite at the Ritz Carlton in uh, Dana Point and we can do a live show there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm in. We'll call it Morning Cappuccino. Oh, oh yes. Sounds good to me. <laughs> Look at it. They the old Ritz Carlton went to this. <laughs> I love that. Yeah, let's let's like give a plug to the Ritz. That's mm. right. All right, so we well we want to thank you. Thank you, Erica Valdez. Everybody, yeah. she's going to be back. Yes. Yeah. So we promised you stuff. She had, she she wanted to come by to wet your whistle, let you know what's coming up. Okay, but she's going to be back. And we're going to get a chance to do all that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. But I also want to know what part of Montana says Mac Port Townsend. It's um, in Bitterroot. Bitterroot? Mm -hmm. okay. where, where do you fly into? Is that where you fly into? Because uh -huh. I think that's where I went. Yes. When I did something. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to be roughing it. There are no limousines out there. <laughs> oh, okay. Montana, yeah, you, you, you end up having to run. Stay humble here. Yeah. No, you but do. I look forward to it. And, and hopefully, if I win, I'll, I'll bring the crown back and we'll do everything together. And thank you so much again for your time. And shout out to Tuesday because we love Tuesday. Oh, yeah. Woo, Tuesday. Yes. 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 Tuesday. Yes. Yes. Tuesday, everybody. Yes. Tuesday, Nunez, everybody. Yes. yes. So we'll take a little quick, we'll take a music interlude. We got to get some pictures with Erica before she leaves because I love mm -hmm. the color. See, I love to, I want to stand next to that. Mm, I got a bike for you. I have to. Yeah, of course it's like lemon meringue. Uh, oh, we'll be right back. Hot.